Hey, Michael, High Power Garage. So, we're just working here on our uh, 5 liter. And uh, we got the intake manifold off. Very, very, very dirty, filthy pig that it is. So, I'll have to give that a uh, pressure wash to start off with. Um, the, uh, if you look inside, I don't, let me see if I can uh, zoom in a bit in here. Can I zoom in a bit? There zooms into the um, coolant passages, and the coolant passages look incredibly good. So if you look right in there, um, except for the tiny little bit of corrosion right here, all inside there looks absolutely fantastic. So I don't know what the story is. Like I say, I know very, very little about this motor. Um, as you can see, pulling off the uh, pulling off the um, intake manifold it's almost impossible to avoid shit getting in there um, there was so much crap but as you can see it's a roller cam motor which is a bonus most of these are after uh, I think 85 or 86 they all had the ability to be roller motors you see the dog bones here the centerpiece so I'll pull that out right now pop the valve covers and uh, just continue on but uh, the big pain is I broke a bolt off here and I broke a bolt off here they literally just snapped first touch of the wrench there was just nothing to them so that kind of sucks but it is what it is that's uh, that's working on a well 96 so 2006 2016 man 26 years old that's that's an old motor ha but um, yeah I'm really happy that the coolant passages are so clean because if the coolant passages are so clean that means for the most part the block will be really clean so it's obviously had great antifreeze in it its whole life um, it's an ex-highways truck so they're typically fairly well maintained because they don't want to have a guy trapped you know 100 miles out of the middle of nowhere but um, yeah so this is our 96 Ford 5 liter and um, this is our teardown all right so like I say, I've got to be super careful with these bolts here. They just snap right off. Those are going to be a pain to get out because they go in like that. But uh, we'll just chip away at it. And uh, if we go with a set of aluminum heads, well, then it doesn't really matter. Over and out. Michael, high power garage, over and out.